Chris Potter, with this heat warning that's in place, the humidity is just tough to deal with. Yeah, and uh, I mean, that was obviously the case today after the early morning rain and thunderstorms cleared. We got back into lots of sunshine. That, along with the southwesterly wind, aided to uh, boost those daytime highs a little bit above projected highs in the low 30s, and it felt at times closer to almost 40. Very similar forecast into the day tomorrow. Uh, the rain and thunderstorm risk will be in a very, very different area because this morning it was across the northeastern shoreline of Lake Erie, Niagara, including the downtown core. Tomorrow it will likely fall just to the north and northeast, but the downtown core might still get some passing showers and that's basically what we escaped with as that line of strong to severe thunderstorms moved in from the southwest it fell apart as expected there still is some thunderstorms over cottage country that will continue to wind down overnight we become cloudy at local fog a few showers once again a few thunderstorms will likely hold just north of the city by the afternoon rain thunderstorm risk in my opinion is gone even though the air is very unstable there's nothing to trigger the redevelopment of showers and thunderstorms so it looks sunny hot dry. Once we get into Friday, another cold front moves through. This will produce once again on and off showers sometimes during the late morning and especially the early afternoon. After it passes, the rainfall risk will diminish. Stable air moves in and it will become cooler and less humid, fresher, if you will, for Saturday with highs near 24, feeling like maybe 25. Similar story for Sunday as well as Monday. Both days will feature mostly sunshine, dry weather, lighter winds for both Sunday as well as Monday compared to Saturday's breezy northerly winds. Highs on Monday climb towards 20 27, but once again, not feeling that much higher. Once we get into Tuesday, we get into a mix of sun and cloud. And although we start to see a little bit more cloud move in on Wednesday, it's only a very slight chance for a local afternoon shower, primarily outside of the city to the west. Highs again near 28, feeling close to 33. And we're going to be close to that value for tomorrow with highs around 32, probably going to feel closer to 40. After morning showers fall, they'll clear. So will the cloud. We're back into sun by the afternoon. Back to you. Thanks so much, Chris. Felix Oje Aliasim is out of the National Bank Open.